Good morning. We are checking out of our Bally Suite that we had a great two night stay in. Um, say goodbye to the view that we didn't really pay much attention to. <laughs> but we're going to head on downstairs and do some mobile checkout. Oh, hold on. Let me turn the light on so you can see me. Uh, do a last little flutter and then head on out and get some breakfast somewhere. We are off the strip now. We have come to, actually let me turn it round this way. The Crown and Anchor Pub for breakfast. And have a nice greasy fry up before we uh, head on down back to Phoenix. Go, crown and anchor. Oh. Yes, thank you. Anywhere on the left or the right side. Anywhere on the right. In here, yeah? Okay, perfect. Thank you. This is the menu. So you can get your sausage rolls, scotch eggs, curry sauce, chip butty, mushy peas. But we're here for the all day breakfast, the full Monty, with some proper bacon and egg. And baked beans so we're going to enjoy that and I'm going to get oh look you can get sticky toffee pudding as well and the prices aren't too bad I mean $5.99 how much is breakfast $11.99 that's pretty good and then Cornish pasties fish and chips bangers and match mash lamb stew ooh, steak kidney pie cottage pie so yeah there's there's pretty much something for everyone banger on a bun I had sausage sandwich yesterday, so. Breakfast has arrived. I have to say, I am really, really looking forward to eating this because I've got proper bacon, and I've got British sausages, and I've got baked beans. So I'm gonna really, really enjoy this. This place never lets us down. If you're in Vegas and you fancy the Full Monty, I would recommend you coming to the Crown and Anchor Pub. We are all breakfasted, feeling much better. Now we've got some food inside us. Now we're gonna head out, fill up. We've got a Sam's Club, which is a bit cheaper because gas prices have shot up recently. And then we're gonna head out back onto the open road towards Phoenix. So I didn't get this coming in because the view wasn't brilliant, but this is Lake Mead in front of us. Levels are really low at the moment. You can see how dry everything is here.
the middle of nowhere at a truck stop called The Last Stop. I'll just pan around. You can actually see there's nothing here. And our power steering's gone. So this could be an interesting journey home. <laughs> hey, we're the Joneses. We don't do things the easy way. Rich is going to get a workout, but what do you do? So as you can see, there is still a whole lot of nothing. Luckily, Rich and I like each other, so we can actually talk to each other. <laughs> but if it gets too boring, we just turn the music up. But we are almost at a place called Wikiup, and there's a place in Wikiup called Lucia's. So if ever you find yourself traveling between Vegas and Phoenix, I would highly recommend you stopping there because they do absolutely fantastic pie. And then they have a little oasis garden out yeah. the back as well with um, stretchy legs. Stretch legs and there's peacocks and a fish pond. So, but we're, we're still motoring on, the car is still working, which is good. So we're just about to pass nothing. If you wanted to know what that was all about, nothing here to see. Well, as you can see, I'm not at home. We've actually come up to Lake Pleasant. This is a lake that's about half an hour north of us. This is where Xander's been for the weekend. He's been staying with Grandad in Grandad's new camper which is right there and there's granddad um, I don't think he wants to come home because we haven't actually seen him yet but I am going to end the vlog here thank you for following along hopefully it won't be too much longer before we get another one done for you uh, we've had fun we're exhausted but uh, hey it's Vegas thank you very much have a good one